Welcome to our lecture online. Here we're given two angles. In essence, we're really given three angles. We have the angle ABD, the angle CBD, and the angle ABC. So there's essentially three angles. But two of the angles are given the indication of an angle in terms of x. And I guess I should write it like this. We have 8x plus 4 degrees and 6x plus 8 degrees for the measure of the two angles. ABD and CBD. So now they're asking us to find the actual measure in terms of degrees given that the angle ABC is a straight angle. So now we have to understand what they mean when they say the angle ABC is a straight angle and so that would be this angle right here. So that indicates that that is 180 degrees. So this implies therefore that the measure of the angle ABC is equal to 100 degrees, which then implies that the measure of the angle ABD plus the measure of the angle CBD together should add up to 180 degrees. So therefore we can say that 8x plus 4, and that would be in degrees, plus 6x plus 8 in degrees is equal to 180 degrees. To make things a little bit easier, we'll just go ahead and drop the degree notation so we can say that 8x plus 4 added to 6x plus 8 must equal to 180, realizing that we're dealing with degrees here. So now what we need to do is solve for x. On the left side, we have 8x plus, 16x, uh, plus 6x, that's together 14x. On the right side, we have 180 minus, when we bring the 8 across, it becomes a minus 8, and when we bring the 4 across, we get a minus 4. That means that 14x is equal to 180 minus 12, or 168. Now, 10 times x is 140, that means 12 times x is 168, so we can divide both sides by 14. That tells us that x is equal to 12. So now that we know what the value for x is, we can find the value for the two measures of the two angles. So now we can say that the measure of the angle ABD is equal to 8x plus 4 degrees. And since x is equal to 12, that's equal to 8 times 12 plus 4, and that would be in degrees, 8 times 12, that would be 96 plus 4, that's equal to 100 degrees. Now for the right side, realizing that since this is a straight angle, this should be 80 degrees, but just to make sure that we have a right rule. So now let's go ahead and calculate the measure of the second angle. We can assume, of course, it's 80 degrees, but let's find out if we're correct. The angle of CBD is equal to 6x plus 8 degrees. And since x is equal to 12, that would be equal to 6 times 12 plus 8 degrees. 6 times 12 is 72, plus 8 is indeed 80 degrees. And 100 degrees added to 80 degrees does indeed add up to 180 degrees, which means that the angle ABC in does indeed have a measure of 180 degrees, which means it is indeed a straight angle. And that's how it's done.